Whoa. The bars aren't nearly as full downtown during the week, and after this past weekend's police raid, people are talking about what the next weekend will bring. 26 bars just like this one were raided this weekend. Now you might be used to seeing signs that say 18 to party and 21 to drink. But after Michael's law passes this July, not only will customers have to be 21, but employees will too. Marin Kazen, an employee at Moonshine Bar, isn't 21 yet and won't be in July either. She says it will affect a lot of students working to pay for their education. Having the after school hours, it just makes it a lot easier for people to have those jobs. And the bar business in Athens is a lucrative business. People make a lot of money. She says it's devastating for people in general, but especially those with a job already. So this job that you've had for maybe a number of years, maybe for just a month or two, you can't have it anymore. But local businesses that are members of the Chamber of Commerce say whatever it is, downtown has always bounced back. The businesses will persevere and everything will be business as usual. As far as the downtown economy, Chastain says history has a way of repeating itself. They say there was an underage drinking bus just six to ten years ago and downtown is still thriving today. Whether it's the local police department doing a raid or a um, statewide breakdown on IDs or whatever it is, the downtown has always bounced back.